the figures for the 2018 Arcana Breeze of Sale remain on par with last year's record-breaking renewal. A slightly bigger catalog returned an increased turnover, while the average price held steady. With Scat Daddy's on high demand, his last offspring on offer commanded a sale topping 825,000 euros. You know, this is the last time you're going to get the chance to buy a colt by the stallion. And, you know, throughout the sales in Europe this year, the two-year-old sales, they've been in very, very high demand. But, but, you know, that's what the horse deserves. I mean, you've got No Nay Never winning races now and looking like being a very good stallion. And, you know, there's Caravaggio, who, who's uh, now standing at Coolmore. And, you know, we wouldn't mind one or two more like him. You know, I, I always like it when you think a horse has just done okay, and then when you get your times back and he's done better, that's a big, that's a huge plus. I've sold a couple of cat daddies already for 800, and I figured he was right up there with those. So I do believe he's the real deal. So uh, I'm, I'm delighted he topped the sale like, because he, sh he deserved it. I thought he was a very nice, straightforward colt. Um, my client asked me to find him a special horse. He's by a, a special racehorse who's becoming a very special stallion and the mare has done nothing wrong. She's already bred a group one winning filly. Look, it was a lot of money when you give that type of money for any horse, it's a lot of money. But look, let's hope he's lucky. The mare has bred a lot of a good, good other, other horses who have been proven to be good as well. So, look, fingers crossed. He was a very clean horse. He vetted excellently. He did a very steady breeze, but look, he's a horse in training who I don't necessarily think was meant to arrive at a breeze up sale, but he, he came here and we were lucky to have the opportunity to get him and we had to stretch to get him, but very happy to get him. 400,000 for a very good looking filly out of exchange rate. What did you like in her? I, her breeze was great. Obviously buying off Willie Brown, I love, great consigner. Um, she had a great attitude and I thought she looked like a Royal Ascot filly and that's what we're looking for, action. George and myself are going to have a discussion this evening about a trainer, but she is definitely going to go to stay in Europe. Um, and probably we would like to think she might run in about three weeks' time, and then Royal Ascot is the plan. I fell in love with her actually as soon as I pulled her out of the stall. It's hard not to, isn't it? For a filly that's bred with so much stamina to have breezed as quick and as well as she done, that's pretty amazing. That was our limit, and um, you know I, I wasn't sure that I'd get her going into the ring because, like I said, I thought she was as good a filly as it is here in the sale and. You know, the stallion is very good and, you know, you're just looking at her here now. I mean, you know, she's, she's just got so much class, hasn't she?